leaders with the Transportation Security Administration are trying to get the word out about the proper way to transport firearms when you fly. They say far too many travelers in Mississippi are failing to properly pack or declare their firearms when they go through the airport. Our Charles Harrington tells you what you need to know if you plan on bringing a firearm with you when you travel. In the last six months, officers with the Transportation Security Administration say they found more than 50 firearms improperly packed in carry-on luggage at airports throughout Mississippi. People are forgetting what's in their bags, these guns in their bags. They are so accustomed to traveling and having guns in their bags. What we're asking you at all times is to know where your gun is. Knowing where that firearm is could save you a lot of money. You could face civil fines up to $15,000 for bringing an undeclared firearm through a TSA checkpoint. There's a proper way to fly with a firearm. First, it must be unloaded and carried in checked baggage only. You have to declare it once you get to the airline that you're flying, and it must be properly packaged in a hard case. There's four uh, type of locks that, that, that is TSA approved and it must be with one of those four locks. The TSA is also reminding air travelers about some of the other items you can't bring in carry-on luggage. This is the old brass knuckles in a silver design, so this is prohibited and is also illegal in the state. This is a skinning knife. Evidently, this passenger was going on a hunting trip and wanted to skin a buck, but not on a plane. Miller says all these items were recently confiscated from travelers at Hattiesburg Laurel Regional Airport. Charles Harrington, WDAM7 on your side. Now you'll be able to find out more about items you can and cannot bring on your flight by checking out this story on our website.